Prince Louis became first royal to miss out on succession privilege after Queen's decision. Her Majesty made a significant amendment to the royal line of succession which meant Louis was the first male not to be ahead of his sister, Princess Charlotte, as heir to the throne. As part of the Succession to the Crown Act 2013, the Queen scrapped male preference primogeniture in time for Prince William's children. The act was brought in the same year the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge's first child Prince George. 7, was born. It meant that William's firstborn child could be a direct heir to the throne, even if they were female. The new rules mean that Princess Charlotte, 6, comes ahead of Prince Louis, 3, in the line of succession. Before the change, Charlotte would have come after Louis just because she is a girl. This is what happened to the Queen's only daughter, Princess Anne, who was born after her brother Prince Charles. The Princess Royal was second in line to the throne until the Queen and Prince Philip had two more sons, Prince Andrew and Prince Edward. Princess Anne was then bumped down the line of succession because her younger siblings were boys. But Prince Louis was still entitled to his Royal Highness title and is fifth in line to the throne ahead of Prince Harry. The Queen also made legal changes to allow Louis and Charlotte to have their HRH titles which before would have only been granted to George as the first child. However, Louis has missed out on other aspects of royal life that his two older siblings have enjoyed. Prince Louis has never traveled abroad with the Cambridges for a royal visit, which seems more unlikely now during the global coronavirus pandemic. George and Charlotte have both been on royal trips abroad with Kate and William. Prince Louis has also not attended a royal wedding yet after being too young for Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's wedding in 2018. Due to the pandemic and wedding guest lists being reduced, the young royal also missed out on attending Princess Beatrice and Eduardo Mapelli Mazzi's private ceremony in 2020.